What is going on, everybody? So today, hey, we got some crazy, crazy news. Holy moly. I think the devs actually heard people. Guess what happened? Um, first, a creator got banned. And then one of the most notorious glitches in the world, Mr. Gray Fox LTD got banned himself too. Now, to be honest, I don't, I can't confirm any of this. I'm just going off of what they said, but this is probably the funniest thing I've read because most of these guys are saying, hey, I'm just making, I'm just posting this video. I only made, I only did the glitch once because, you know, I just want to show everybody how it's done to put, put notice out on the map so the developers can help fix this. And then, hey, and then there was people who said, oh, I only did it once just to make sure that it was able to be done so I can report it myself. But then there's videos and, and videos and videos of these people doing it over and over and over. <laughs> Uh, bro, these dudes are a joke. But don't worry, guys. What we're going to do here is we will be going through everything we learned. And I'm telling you, it's pretty, pretty embarrassing, right? Something probably one of the funniest things that I've seen. So if you guys head over to my Twitter, you guys might notice, well, this cow actually wrote this. The band hammer is out. And then he tags a couple content creators. says, do not do the invisible glitch. Devs are not playing this time. And he, all he had was a picture is your account has been banned please contact customer support now i was like were you banned or is this a as a troll because you know a lot of these guys just like to troll a lot and no he I, he wrote i was i wrote who where is it whose account and then someone said off got banned i think they are hitting everybody that posted the glitch now i thought this was pretty hilarious because i i do not like the dude the dude is one of those people who is just toxic always going after creators just man did you Make content, focus on yourself, and keep moving forward, and that's how you grow. You ain't got to try to go out there, try to pick battles with different creators. I probably, if you look any of my, con I don't think there's one video I've ever made going after a content creator specifically. Not not once, right? So this is pretty funny um, that he did get banned, and I wanted to know more about this. Like, I wanted to find out if he did. So later on in the day, right? Later on in the day, I go up and I see... This, um, where is it at? This one. I, I see this, right? So I click on Mr. Gray Fox because you remember he was a he was one of the biggest glitchers. Everybody was posting videos saying that he only did it one time. But it looks like it finally caught up to him. The glitching caught up to Mr. Gray Fox LTD. Well, let, let's go. Where is it at? Um, we go to tweets, we go down, and let's keep keep going. Well, you keep going down. We're gonna read his, his thing right here. So I go up and you can see I muted most of these people. And right here it says, and then off said, were you banned? And then Gray Fox says, weak suspension for using the exploit. <laughs> yes, he was using the exploit multiple videos, not just one time. And he deserved 100% the ban. And then look, off said, thank you. I find it odd that mine was for information and to help others, but it is what it is. So they keep going down and says, no, I get it. I could have gone about it differently. Instead of baiting content creators to show me off invisible, probably should have just done it recording and sent it to them without killing anybody. No, he was killing multiple players, right? And he was doing it over and over and over. So my whole thing on this is they got what they deserved at the end of the day, but that means that at the end of the day, the devs are actually, they're actually banning people who are using exploits. And this is a step in the right direction because this glitch is literally running wildfire. And for them to come out and say, look, we haven't been able to fix it, we're working on it, but if you're doing it, you're gonna be banned. 100% agree with it. Do not care whether you're the one showing it, whether you're the one doing it, you're, you're contributing to it, right? Hey, but look at this. Then I find out this dude off is like, oh, I didn't do it. I, I only did it once. I only show people, but look, look this is this. Someone actually comes out in comments and says, not really, Off was in the DZ, invisible, as a healer. They were investigating some of his clips and I'm one of the ones who reported him and sent this video evidence. So, looks like he got caught in a lie. And, and I literally say dudes are out here showing how to do the glitch just one time, saying that's all they did, but then they're caught on multiple clips over and over and over and you guys saw those clips of people going invisible you saw that those clips of people just doing the wrong thing and really ruining the experience for all the creators 
and all the players out there, right? Like people are going out there trying to have fun and they can't have fun in the DZ. The DZ was almost unplayable to a point and it was about time that they stood down and they cracked down and anybody who's been using it deserves a ban. Now it's not, it looks like it's not a permanent ban. It looks like it's a, a weak ban. So you, you take your lickings, you, you hang out for a little bit, you think about your mistakes and you come back later, right? And if you wanna keep glitching, if you get caught again, well, maybe it'd be a permanent ban, but at least they are banning people, whether it's a one week permanent ban, I believe it's just one week, and letting people know if you keep doing this, you won't be playing the game. And I'm glad to see the devs stood up and did something. And hopefully all of you guys who are enjoying the DZ now can enjoy it in peace and not have to worry about these people using the glitches and cheating. And hopefully they, they, they fix the bigger issue and they fix the problem. But obviously that takes time. They got to figure out what's causing it. And hopefully in 16.2 that comes out. But right now, the bigger thing is, yo, they're banning people, man. And this is probably the best thing that's happened for the PvP community is banning cheaters who are cheating. And hopefully they continue to do this, right? Because if you don't, it just gets spreads like wildfire. Like I, I and I've never seen a Ubisoft company do this. Like Rainbow Six bans people left and right. Even just for harassing players in game, they ban people. And, and that's the crazier part that they're so lenient or they have been in the past that these bans are coming. And I'm glad, I'm glad to see it. I am 100% all about them standing up for those players who wanna play legit and are getting terrorized by these players who, who are just doing their thing. But hey, now they learn. Hey, Mr. Gray Fox, I guess you just didn't do it one time because the evidence was there. All right, guys, we're gonna wrap it up here. Appreciate the support, appreciate the love. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hey, nothing but skills out. Take it easy, everybody.